Now, I want you to be careful where you actually get your bulk mail marketing materials, where you get your names, your addresses, information of so potential clients that you want to actually reach out to. So I want you to be careful with this. Even though the HIPAA rules says that you are free to market your services, your products, your services to any potential patients, getting a list of these prospects from referral sources can land you in hot waters under the provisions of the patient's protections. So remember, HIPAA protects patient information, so your list can't come from someone who treated your target market unless that patient has expressly consented. One example is this. There are people out there who has worked for other home health agencies, whether as a nurse, as a biller, whether as a QA nurse or a data entry person, and they feel that they have lists of patients that they can actually come to another agency and sell those lists to those agencies. So be wary about those of those type of people who are trying to bring lists from other companies. So even if you want to overlook that, I really suggest that you do not overlook it at all. There are companies in the internet where you can actually enter a bunch of demographic information of who you want to target and you can actually get the list of these people. Those are perfectly fine. Those list builders are not coming from people who work on those target areas. And you have proof of a purchase of those items. So I want you to be careful on where you get your listings. Now, isolating a specific individual or groups for marketing purposes could expose you to so many penalties.